Today, I'm going to show you an expansion technique called Explain by Example. But before I start the expansion technique itself, I'm going to give you a little bit of linguistic information. We're going to discuss hyponyms. Think about a list. Red, blue, white, green, orange. How are those things the same? They're all colors. The words on the list are hyponyms because they are underneath. But the label on top, the word colors, is a hypernym because it's on top, it's above. Another name for hypernym is a superordinate. This technique is important because ASL has less hypernyms than English does. We have a few, like food, animals, furniture, but English has a lot more. Imagine with me for a minute. Recently, an old woman passed away. Now, her family's all circled around, and the lawyer gets her will, opens it up, and starts reading. You're the interpreter for her deaf granddaughter. And the lawyer says, she left you all her jewelry. The word jewelry has no sign. So what do you do with that? You explain by example. Grandma, her rings, necklace, earring, bracelet, handed down, gifted to you. But, you can use it for other words, too. For example, the word demographics doesn't have a sign. But what does it mean? It means to gather information about people like their race, age, gender, etc., usually for marketing purposes. Many times, you need to use a cue. So you can start with the sign, you know, or that, or etc. after. Let me show you another example. Like the phrase, the Middle East. You know, Iran, Israel, Syria, Lebanon, that area. 